Well, goats and sheep are commonly used to help reduce wildfire threats by clearing away dry brush. But today, another flock is being deployed to help fight flooding. So tonight, Marley's getting answers on how these animals are helping keep creeks from overflowing and getting reaction from people who live nearby about their new hungry neighbors. This herd of goats and sheep is the latest tool to fight flooding in Sacramento County. They come out and eat the grass along this culvert to make sure that we don't have any blockages when the rains fall. I think that's amazing. I've never seen that. When strong winter storms hit, Sacramento becomes one of the most flood prone regions in the nation. And these local creeks can rapidly rise and spill over the banks towards homes. Well, the water does get pretty high up pretty quick, especially when it's raining a lot. Last year it was pretty high and it's it's just scary because the house are nearby. Anna Cardoso's parents live right behind Strawberry Creek and took measures last winter to stop the water from getting into their home. It was January, I believe. It went up to like the back of her yard and it was like almost trying to come in, but they were able to put bags of rice and stuff to kind of keep it from going inside. About 300 animals are currently clearing brush along Strawberry Creek near Calvine Road. And once they've finished here, they'll move up north to Arcade Creek. It takes about seven Seven days. These goats are very professional. They get the job done quickly and make sure that they don't leave anything behind. Many people who live near the creek support this environmentally friendly way to clear the overgrown brush. I think it's really smart to actually have goats instead of, you know, like just chemicals because it will go into the ground and maybe mess up with mess with the other plants. And even though it may be an unusual sight to see out your backyard fence, the goats and sheep are growing on these homeowners. I think it's a great idea. I mean, they're enjoying themselves. They're kind of just roaming around. Yeah, great work. Well, there's a team of goat herders that stay with the animals 24 hours a day to make sure they don't escape the temporary fences that have been installed. The animals are scheduled to be used along the creeks for the next five weeks.